So I'm just show y'all how I do like this the investigating that I do. All right. So I was thinking about the energy, you know, the nuclear bio energy, bio nuclear, bioelectric, biokinetics. All right. And we do have this energy in us. I mean, everyone knows this. All right. So I was thinking, well, that's has something to do with chakras somewhere. Well, I started looking up the nerves, and lo and behold, when you consider the nuclear and electric of the brain, that's two, three, four, five, six, seven. There's the seven chakras of the body. And what I think would be, I haven't even looked into it yet, but I guarantee it's going to corroborate this theory that I'm about ready to give. That what it is, is this body of nerves connecting to another body of nerves, similar to how a master hard drive has a slave drive connect to it. It's a different body of nerves, all on its own here, that does something and thinks for itself, but it's still hybridly connected with the other drive. See what I'm saying? They both have a, the same operating system, but they're both like fingers of this operating system. See what I'm saying? I, I'm coinciding this with my knowledge of computers, PCs. I, I've built them for over 25 years probably. So, I mean, this operates the same. I, I guarantee you when I start looking into the nerves, I'm, I'm going to look into the nervous system and start seeing if I can find things that will corroborate this. But I guarantee this has to do like with the with nuclear and electric energy, like I've been talking about on my channel, that and the metaphysics, that if we learn how to create technology that can amplify these certain chakras with, say, just a suit, a suit that has some kind of electrical stimulation or connection to the brain that would help you operate, like, on a higher level. I mean, literally, like uh, like a superhero. No shit. I mean, literally. I am I mean, just don't... Don't let everything fall apart just because I said the word superhero, you know. But think about what I'm saying. It's not far off. Metaphysics. I mean, when you think about it, a metahuman. I mean, all of our stuff, on the, our, even the concept of it existing, is not even impossible at all. In fact, that's what humans are here for. To be more than we are. Be all that you can be. It, it goes a little bit higher than the army, you know what I'm saying? But I'm going to start looking into this, into the nervous system and everything. And I'm going to start looking into... How nerves grow and this and that. I'm going to start looking into it. I mean, I already know right now that every one of these bodies does its own instructions. Because there are one, there are some. Of course, this one goes all over the body. Your brain controls everything. But these have a sub-system that they like help you breathe or help you your heart beat. Or, you know, help your stomach work, you know, for your, your guts to work, you know. for This is right here is for your, your uh, sexual drive, you know. So... These nerves would control the lower part portion of your body, lowest. This would control the abdominal. This would control your thorax. This would control your neck. And this would control everything else. Of course, everything in your head, too. See what I'm saying? So, I think uh, this is where chakras are... Uh, this I'm about ready to start getting into this. And I guarantee it starts... It falls together perfect. How much you want to bet? Because everything else has fallen together perfect. And look how well that just fell together. I mean, it seems pretty damn plausible, doesn't it? It's, it's very possible. It's actually more than plausible. It's possible. It's true, actually. This is what's being suppressed when it comes to physics and the, the truth of behind knowing the nature of the universe. Once we understand the nature of the universe, we will understand this stuff. And the fact is, we're not getting any better by suppressing it. I wish, I wish people would help me get this idea out.